Assalamu alaikum welcome back to another new video in this video we are gonna talk about a brand new machine which is surgical mask making machine uh, here you can see this machine is a cutting unit and the ear loop is also included in this cutting machine okay so this is like a different kind of design and uh, this design included solid work 2d solid work 3d uh, bill of materials pdf and steps file so let's see uh, what is included in the project file here is the project file here is the project file and here you can see uh, assembly format steps files are also included then uh, front frame uh, different kind of parts are separated in different folder okay so uh, if i short it like according to the size and open the biggest one then we can see what is inside the design okay in this folder we'll get this frame and if we go back then open another one here you can see every folder has some small parts so let's talk about uh, let's talk about the main unit and see how this machine works and what is included in this machine okay so so the material frame is looks like same one two three four layers four layers and one nose bar are here okay so it is like uh, almost same in every machine you you know how to make this because this is like pretty common and similar and you can buy this part ready-made from the market or even you can make it by yourself based on the design so i'm not gonna spend that much time to explain those everything because those are like very common things and here you can see the tension frame tension clip then there is a folding roller okay there is a folding roller folding clip uh, here is a folding clip then the tension clip again so the main mechanism started from here okay the main mechanism started from here here you can see the nose bar injection system let me zoom in a little bit then you can understand and see clearly here you can see uh, here you can see the nose bar injection system here uh, automatic nose bar uh, in, in injected into the mask by this unit okay and this unit has like several gears and those are interconnected with the main unit okay i will rotate it and show you how everything is interconnected okay so here you can see all the gears are connected with the motor what is the motor zoom out a bit okay hide this and you can see a motor gear motor is connected here and in this machine they used two piece of ultrasonic machine okay two set ultrasonic machine increase the speed of this uh, machine okay so ultrasonic machine price is like lower right now compared to the previous month so you can think about this design because this design is like a little bit less complicated and easy to make so here you, you can see the gears so here is the belt here is the belt you need uh, actually three chain to connect everything and when this machine will run it will it would looks very awesome because uh, there are so many gears and all are simultaneously connected each other and it, it would be looking very good so anyways here is the motor motor configurations are available in the uh, build of materials list so you can buy it from your local market and you can also buy inverter speed controller then you don't need any plc or anything because uh, because like uh, this machine only has uh, two electronic component which is ultrasonic machine and the motor 
so if you have motor controller then ultrasonic machine has its own control control box so you don't need to worry about it and you don't need to make super fancy uh, here you can see the cooling fan this ultrasonic machine has one cooling fan attached so some countries uh, weather are very hot in that situation you can use two cooling fan for each unit of machine uh, then your ultrasonic machine would be long lasting okay so uh, here is the uh, screw long screw which is used to attach ultrasonic machine with the table and this every piece of every piece of ultrasonic machine need a frame like this and this frame is connected by four screw and very strongly connected with the table okay so hide those things small part and see what is inside okay so you got the idea how this ultrasonic machine works uh, when you buy it uh, the control box of this ultrasonic machine will come together okay here is another small part if i hide those things you can see another synchronized gears available inside uh, if i zoom in you can see it more clearly okay so here you can see let me move it a little bit like this and you can see what is inside okay hide those frame that will give us a clear view Here is the cutting roller there is a blade inside and here is four hole to attach the blade okay and here is the gear and of course this gear is interconnected and well synchronized here is another roller and when the cutting roller connected with this roller at this that time there is a cutting mechanism happened here okay and here is the fabrics the fabrics is coming from the material rack and after getting sealed and nose bar injected it is just going out in this area by this area so uh, let's hide one by one and see uh, what is inside and how you can make the machine this gears looks easy you can make it but uh, when you don't have the design it will be very difficult to make it because you need to tuning you need to do so much tuning and it wouldn't work perfectly so i will suggest you to have a design and uh, try to make this mask making machine based on the design without design like without map you cannot find your destination uh, same as like this a machine without a design you cannot make it perfectly okay so uh, this cutting unit we already hidden the cutting unit then okay zoom out okay so here is one extra part of set available and this set used to make the ear loop okay so this part is extra in this machine previous generation machine we didn't have this part and mainly this part is like like uh, making the uh, ear loop mechanism so if i zoom in a little bit then you can see what is inside two side has two roller this two side has two roller and here there are some clip and i will give uh, a video and if you see the production video you will understand how this machine works and how these clips works okay even there are many 
uh, videos about production in YouTube you can also check those videos okay so this is like a simple folding mechanism and uh, nothing that complicated you will understand it how to make it okay so let's come back to the main unit and and disassemble one by one and here is like a control box you can make a fancy task screen control box or you can even make the manual control box uh, here is the uh, supporting part supporting part you you can see there are mainly two separated supporting part this unit is uh, pretty different than this unit there is the ultrasonic uh, first ultrasonic um, cutting unit uh, sealing unit and this roller only seal two side of the mask and here here we have another another cutting roller and another ultrasonic machine so here is the horn of ultrasonic let me hide this thing and hide those little part here is a screw and the work of this uh, screw is to adjust the tension of the uh, of the roller because every time you need to put uh, you need to put inside put the fabrics inside at that time you need to readjust this roller you need to lose it put inside then you need to readjust that's why it is like uh, very important to have it and here is another cutting roller we have seen uh, one cutting roller in this area and we have found another cutting roller here okay on the second piece of ultrasonic machine and here we can see another roller okay this one looks like a rubber roller okay so if you got the idea how this part works let's hide these things and see that it looks like so many pinium inside gears inside okay so i'm not gonna hide all the part if you got the idea basic idea how this machine works and let's come in this area here is the tension clip and uh, you can lose it or you can make it tighter to adjust the cutting size okay after putting inside you don't need to adjust manually everything you just make it tight a little bit and uh, you can also loosen a little bit and see the cutting is working properly or not okay and by um, tuning this this tension clip you can actually adjust the size of cutting it is the rubber roller and by the help of this two rubber roller the materials just uh, just come okay this rubber roller is very effective you just take out the materials from the machine it is the ultrasonic horn and uh, here is the ultrasonic roller and here is the ultrasonic roller Frame. and there is something missing looks like uh, you must use one spring just you must use one spring just uh, under this frame okay just here but I don't know why did they didn't use this uh, in the design uh, there is oh, of course there is two there is two spring position and you can see one and two let me zoom in and show you a little bit and if you see here is and here is you need to use two small little spring here okay because ultrasonic machine it is a vibrating machine so without that spring maybe your maybe your uh, ultrasonic machine would damaged so uh, if you want it work properly you need to use 
a spring actually two spring here two spring in this side uh, same for every ultrasonic machine ultrasonic roller okay it is applicable for all ultrasonic roller and here is the nose bar unit and here is the nose bar unit and here is a plate you can see uh, so this nose bar unit is also uh, very familiar and this is the machine you already got the idea how uh, you can make the machine i'm not gonna disassemble everything so that's all for today i hope you guys liked the video and i'm making many videos every day and uh, uploading to our channel if you are interested in different kind of machine design uh, you're welcome to subscribe us and if you wanna uh, get this design uh, you are welcome to visit our website website links are available in the description below and uh, that's for all today